In this video, we will create a Sankey diagram with Microsoft's quarter 4 for year 2023 income data. Sankey chart data requirements. You need between 2 and 8 columns of categorical data to create a Sankey chart. Categorical data definition, it describes a characteristic or a category of data. It takes on values that are names or labels. Categorical data is also called qualitative data. You need one column of numerical data to create a Sankey chart. Numerical data definition. It is in the form of numbers and is numeric in nature. It can be counted or measured and can be arranged in a logical order. Numerical data is also called quantitative data. In this video, we will construct a Sankey chart with seven data columns as follows. Six columns containing categorical data. One column containing numerical data. Important, Sankey chart will only accept data in columns as shown in the image on the left. Click on the Add-ins button. Install Chart Expo add-in, enhance your charting experience with advanced charts. An add-in is software that adds new features into Microsoft Excel and Office 365. How to install Chart Expo video is available in iCard, located in top right corner. Video link is also provided in the description below, please click on more. Once the Chart Expo add-in is installed, it should display an Office add-ins box. Select the Chart Expo add-in and click on the Add button. Select the Sankey chart. Select the data. Click on the Create Chart from Selection button. Sankey chart is created successfully. Click on the Edit Chart button. Click on the Chart Header pen to edit the properties. Then enter the header text. Make sure you have turned on Show Property before you click the Apply button. Click on the Settings button to change the chart settings. Click on the Drawing Mode section. By default, negative number support is disabled. You can enable negative number support by sliding the Enable Negative Data button to the right, that is turning it on. Click on the Node Properties pen to edit the properties. Click on the Node section. You can hide Node Outline by sliding the Show Node Outline button to the left, that is turning it off. You can change the color of Node. You can set the color direction for Node Links. We will select the option Node Links Write One Level from the list. You can set the node's width. Change the color off all nodes. Click on the Node Properties pen to edit the properties. Click on the Node section. You can change the color of node. We will select the option Node Links Left One Level from the list. Change the color off all nodes. Click on the Node Properties pen to edit the properties. Click on the Number section. You can set the number precision. You can change the format type. You can set the currency format in uppercase or lowercase.
Click on the Node Properties pen to edit the properties. Click on the Percentage section. You can show or hide percentage. Click on the Node Properties pen to edit the properties. Click on the Symbols section. You can show or hide parentheses. You can set prefix to prepend dollar as a prefix to the numbers. Click on the Level Properties pen to edit the properties. Click on the Text section. You can show or hide level labels. The impact of this change will appear after you click on the Save Changes button. Click on the Save Changes button. Click on the Export Chart button to export chart in JPG, PNG, SVG, or PDF. Following versions of Excel are supported by Chart Expo. We appreciate your business, thank you. Please remember to subscribe to our channel.